This space is absolutely fantastic for my kind of relationship with sculpture, which is very much about the physical encounter, that there isn't the best view. You have to keep walking, you have to keep finding what this experience is. And the real strength for me about sculpture is this impossibility to recall it in its totality. I wanted something that had a potential for being ephemeral, something that maybe has a fluidity. Each banner, each single object, is made out of the offcuts of other works that have come back to the studio. The orange bags were already in existence from an exhibition in Kiev. The posts are made out of all these offcuts joined together and then the banners are made out of offcuts of fabric from various other works I've made with that fabric. I like this association with something that may not be finished, that has another stage to go, and that perhaps that for a viewer is quite challenging, you know, where is this work? What is its future? For me, that's be always been an incredibly important part of sculpture. There is the potential for another process to be continued. The banners, they were made for an exhibition in Dallas at the Nasher Sculpture Center. Now, Dallas is an extraordinary city. There's nothing there, in a way, other than these great facades. But everywhere, the thing that moves in that city are the flags. The Texan flag, the American flag, flags for businesses, flags for outside people's houses. And for me, there was a, a fascination with something that is a symbol of great authority, power, and nationalism also translating the exactly the same form into all sorts of other potentials, whether it's protest or celebration, that extraordinary breadth of interpretation I find very powerful. The flag that doesn't have a specific meaning is an ambiguous object and then to repeat it so many times and then to have it compressed. It becomes something that is waiting to have meaning attached to it because it is such a strong visual form. I think that state of objects where they, they have their meaning removed, I mean, it's almost like entropy, but the form remains. I think I am fascinated by that.